and aquifera drinking water treatment designs all operate with, by gravity with no electricity. And we were committed to this design principle and as such had not yet developed a filtration device because we couldn't see a way to clean it without using electricity. We had a team in the spring of 2010 who worked to investigate different filtration options to see if we could come up with something that would work for these communities to further improve the quality of the water that came out of the water treatment plants. Um, from that, we developed the idea to have a stacked rapid sand filtration system, which basically takes a standard rapid sand filter and stacks six of them on top of one another and distributes the water among those layers so that in forward motion, one sixth of the water goes through each of the layers, but in backwash, when you're trying to clean the water, all the flow is directed towards one layer at a time. You're basically multiplying the pressure given by the water times six, which is enough to clean it without a pump. So here we have the lab scale device, which is quite large and has six layers of sand. Each layer is 20 centimeters. So the water will come in from the exit of the plant from up there, travel through these tubes, and enter each of the layers through these um, ports. It goes into the sand, the water splits, and half goes up and half goes down, and then exits through the exit channels over here and travels up to the top where it will be disinfected and delivered to the distribution tank. Then when you need to clean the filter after it's been running for about two days, it has gathered enough sediment that it needs to be cleaned. Then you turn off each of these inlets and direct all the water to the inlet at the bottom, increasing the pressure experienced there. That fluidizes the bed, which basically makes the sand grains um, flow in a fluid motion. The, the sand rises up and is completely full of water, is rinsed, cleaned, the particulate matter comes out with that dirty backwash water and is put to waste. Then you turn, you, you turn off that valve and open it up to run in forward motion the way it normally runs, and then you have a clean filter that's operating well. You have a small volume of backwash water that is dirty, that goes into waste, um, and then you can continue to run your filter.